We made it to Desolation. We're currently camped out in the trailer right next to Hibernia, and I guess we get to go try to fix a transmitter here in this episode. Hello, everybody. This is Frogman. Welcome back to The Long Dark. And, uh, well, I think one of the last little bitty things that our poor little Astrid is going to have to worry about on this end of the world. So, uh, yeah, let's check a few things out in here. I do believe we have a little bit of um, food and possibly a couple of other things. Um, I do kind of want to take a nap, possibly, and maybe see about getting a little bit of time on it, but then we might, may or may not be able to get that uh, Aurora to trigger exactly how we want to. So, um, I guess, let's go out here and make sure Mr. Wolf is not where he was at the end of the episode last time. I don't... Yeah, he's still here. I was going to say, I don't think I hear him, but uh, we'll, we'll just deal with what we need to do. So let's get us another torch. Not that we don't have 100,000 torches. And we'll go try to see about getting into at least the main building over here and do a little bit more looting. We do need a whole bunch of scrap metal. And we have not. No, that's not good. He might be running away from a bear. Okay, there's the tower. Unfortunately, it's really nasty out here right now. We're a little, I should say a little, a uh, little overweight, but we'll go ahead and just kind of take a look at a few things here. There is a battery right here that we need to grab. So we'll go ahead and grab that battery and take it over there and plug it into the, the box. So, let's see what we get in here. Where are our matches gonna be? I got another bandage and some more dog food. Look around, look around. More wires, plenty of wire. I mean, we, we should be just perfectly fine on all of the parts as long as the battery is where the battery needs to be. There are my matches. Okay, cool. Do we get the thing underneath the desk over here? No, it's not in here this time. Okay. Um, well, we'll just kind of keep looking around. Let's just see what we find. Is the battery sitting right where it usually is sitting? Uh-oh. Wonder where they put it this time. I get another lantern. How much is in it? Not much. It can stay right there. All right, let's check a few boxes then. We'll check some containers. Dump a little bit of our weight off because we're going to be here for a little bit. Hey, here we go. And anything else? Not a toque. I don't really want it, but I took it anyway. Check all these real quick, and then we'll go poke our heads in the locker and dump the lockers and dump a bunch of stuff away. Because we do have a lot of stuff on us right now. We'll take this one. All right, let's get light. Well, we'll just uh, deal with the fact that we're not gonna get much lighter than that right now. Of course, as soon as we dump a bunch of these uh, these fuses in these wires, we'll get a little better. I think we'll just go ahead and search the whole building and then we'll see about where we are in the morning once we get her figured out. It's not that I need to have a uh, an Aurora right off tonight. We can definitely go do a little wandering around the area. So, let's see about this. More fuses. Note. Nothing here. I might go ahead, actually, and start a fire because, it, you know, we don't have a massive amount of water, but we do have enough, at least for the night. And we'll just put... Uh, I will just put one coal on that and a pot just in case. And look around. There's another whetstone. There's the battery. Okay. Um, that's going to be utter pain because that's going to really, really, really make us slow. But that's okay. We'll deal with it as we work our way through this area. Plenty something. Whoa. 
Okay, well this one should go quickly then. And then it's going to go all the way around to the other side. All right, cool. Are we going to get anything fun? Nope, the inventory's bugged again. Love it. This one does that so much. No, I don't want your cash. There is a distress pistol. I would have loved to have had some flare shells, but that's fine. Uh, there's probably another flare shell, the distress pistol, in this area. We'll take a look around really quickly of wood laying there. Let's go up here and take a check and see if there's anything behind here. Uh, just the backpack this time. Okay, so not much. We'll deal with that later. Ground, another flare. Beautiful. More wires. Let's start making some fishing lures with these wires. We're about done with all of this stuff, so uh, let's go up the pipe, see if there's anything good up here. I'm going to get a cup of coffee and some ketchup chips. Come on, stand up, let's get out to hear you. Got a container this time. Interesting, and do we get some food? We get a, an advanced guns gun book and some sardines. No, thank you for the book, it can stay there. Everything else we'll take with us. I can stand up, maybe we can get this to work a little bit. All right, and then we'll go around over there. See if there's anything good here. Sometimes there's a pry bar on this wall. If you're looking for one, that's where they kind of tend to show, where one tends to show up. Anything else good? Another fuse and another container. What is this, I wonder? Uh, I don't want your hat. Thermal underwear. Interesting. Just a piece of paper. Okay, cool. Nice. Another pair of underwear that we don't need, but we'll, we'll, we'll take it. Sure. And then the door. Go outside really quickly and take a look at something. Sometimes there's a box right here. It's not here today. It's probably around the corner then. Don't think I hear the bear. I thought for a second there he might be there. All right, let's get back over to our fire. We'll take care of a couple of things. I gotta go up there and check that guy and see if he's got anything good. And then we'll see about doing things in the morning. Yeah, I don't see anything in th that backpack usually has nothing in it. So 30 minutes, good. You have time, put your torch out. Now we're really heavy. I guess you can uh, just take that torch and we'll walk upstairs and we'll deal with rebuilding everything and all that kind of stuff in the morning. Come on. Yep, that's right. Throw it on the floor. guy is, see if he's got anything good for us. Come on. You'll usually have a torch at least, but sometimes there's some stuff here. Thank you. 
Ah, thank you. More more food. That's all we need. Good deal. All right. We'll go put her to bed, and then we'll fix the uh, the transmitter. Alrighty then, next morning, let's do a few things. Let's see about putting some of this weight down. I mean, I did make way too much water, and again, we may come back or we may not, doesn't really matter. Uh, that should help a little. It's that battery that's gonna get us, plus I need to cut up a shelf. I don't see, I have not seen hardly any scrap metal laying around, so how much is that gonna get us? Go ahead, chop that up. And that up. That should get us all the parts we need to be able to do that piece, plus be able to fix our hacksaw afterwards. And then I gotta drag that heavy thing outside. I'm not gonna be able to carry this load. Then go put it in the thing. And yes, I finally turned the voice back on. So, hopefully no bear. I don't hear any bear, I just hear the water. Stomp, 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 stomp. Nope. Okay, well, let's go get this done. And then, like I said, this one should uh, light up all the fun stuff that we can find in Coastal Highway, so we may have a good time when we get over there. So, no bear. Put down. I don't know why you stood back up. Turn it on, and then guaranteed tonight we will have an Aurora. So let's go check out a couple of things over here. I guess we'll check these trailers. Let's go in to the middle and do this one first. See if we get anything in the Narnia trailer. and that is it. Mm, oop, oh, 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 missed that one. And then go back outside and go back in. It still cracks me up that that does that. All right, all the way to the end here, there may or may not be something laying in the floor. I guess we can get our lantern out so we can actually see. I don't know why this trailer is so dark. Nothing. Don't see anything there. There's a locker. Nothing in the shelf. Nope. Nothing in there. Where's the whetstone? Oh, there it is. I was going to say, um, usually you get one in here, so that's good. Cool. Uh, let's go outside. All right. So, I think the only thing we're going to do now is I'm going to go in here. I'm going to deliver a few things or drop a couple of things off. I'm going to probably leave a reasonable amount of the fuses and parts in here 
so we're we're not that bad for being overweight right now but i'd like i don't need that for sure i already have one that works and i guess i can eat the rest of this dog food drop that can all right let's go take a look over to the riken maybe We'll go check that out real fast. I think we're doing reasonably well. I kind of want to do a little beach comb today since we have the majority of the day to do it. Maybe I should just go do that, except I'm awful heavy right now. Uh, yeah, and he's right here too. Okay, well, we'll go over to the right and then. Like I said, we'll go over here and check this first. gonna get it and I'll take your soda thank you There's the guy over there today nope all right cool so let's go check this out see if there's anything good in it and then I think we'll walk over to the ice and walk down to um, Scruffy's cave bunch of stuff filing cabinets eh, more stuff that I don't need is it a real book or just a book book it is a book book. Okay. Put some of this junk away that I know you're carrying at this point. I don't need that, and I don't need that, and I really don't need those. They can stay in there forever. Let's go see what's over here by the forge. A Carl Bob. And a bandage. Piece of coal. Several more pieces of coal. Good. Upstairs. A sewing book once again we'll gather up and read once we get a little bit of food a little bit of extra food nothing in any one of those containers and then let's go up here cool and a, a message whether or not we feel like going and getting it, there is a uh, cash box that's sitting right over there that is full of flares, the blue ones. Okay, well, let's go check out the ice. We'll start like right over there and just work our way back, I guess. quickly I mean, we weren't in there very long huh silly old bear we'll see if we find anything on the ice out here today oh yeah we do there's already something going to get a locker and we're going to get a sapling no I see 
something else. I see a bunch of stuff, actually. Good deal. Ah, uh, cattail we'll take. And a stick I'll take. And a dead fish I will take. I will take some of this, some of that. Another sapling. Scrap metal. No corpse over here today. That's interesting. Huh. There's another spot that happens right here that sometimes does things and sometimes doesn't. We have to stop and cook this fish. Oh, there's a burdock up there too. Okay. Here, let's see if we can find a spot out of the wind. And I will just go ahead and warm that and drink it for now. I guess I do have a couple of other things we could be cooking. Let's see, cook another thing here. I do have a few things I can cook. Let's get one of those down. Rotten fish. I can't feel my hands. What do I have? I can just do whatever with. Let's make another one of those teas real fast. All right, let's go see what we get out here. Got a slightly lighter, but not by much. Midday, one down arrow. We're not doing bad. I think the next spot's like right over here. Love to find something fun. Go back to the Riken then. <laughs> I'm just gonna press, press, press auto walk and let her walk over here. That's interesting. Okay, so you can't do it right here. I'm gonna drop this fish in the firewood right here. So, boink. That is not what I wanted to do. But that's fine, we need another torch anyway. Dump this excess stuff real quick. I'll drop two of those two. Now I want to go look at something because if I can ice fish right here fairly close, that's not terrible. Where's the thing? Okay. 
How close can I be? Okay, well that's neat to know. What about the other side? So I might go set one of these up for a little bit. Cool. So you could theoretically just put all kinds of those things out here and just have a big ice fishing empire right here, too. Cool. Um, well, uh, time's it. You will be fine, my dear. Torch is going to go out, sure, but whatever. gonna put this thing on it with the lure and start and you can go and we'll see what we get out of that we'll go back inside real quick warm up a little bit more of this line right over here. There's one more spot kind of right over there. I don't want to be so exhausted I can't do something tonight if we do get, well, when we do get the Aurora, I do want to kind of see if there's anything here. I don't know if there are any caches here. Sometimes there's one more over here. check out Scruffy's cave and then I guess go back to the Riken and wait for an Aurora if we have time now oh, we get the odd fish I do love that odd fish Shoot, I should have put down a bunch of saplings too, shouldn't I? I have a, what, three now? Is that one cured? No, what does that? And that scrap metal, I can just drop it. We don't need it right now. We can just go out here somewhere. You do want to kind of try to move them, especially this stuff. This stuff is the, uh, the old spawn the the old spawn still do happen so like the random junk that shows up on the side of the uh, ice after a couple of weeks in game we'll just start putting things out and then there's the blizzard stuff that is kind of going to override it the blizzard stuff will replace itself over time but this stuff generally will not respawn unless you clean the ice up and that like the wood and sticks and things like this, those are the things that will spawn in the, the medicine or the, uh, the clothing, or the shoes or stuff like that. Let's go see what we get over here real fast. ship and take a nap. Oh, you're fine. We're going to be busy tonight. Where are you? There you are. Over here. Well, we know what 
that's over here. We're gonna have to go say hi to him. Don't use that one. Use one of these. We can drop you, pick you up, use that. Okay, it should have lit and should have stayed lit. Okay, good. I, I, you got to be careful when you do that going in and out of caves. If you're in the middle of the action of it lighting, it sometimes might fail and you lose the stuff in the process. Lose the match, maybe. Any coal today? Doesn't seem like it here. Let's go up the hill first. This time huh let's go back down and go check this deer out maybe he followed us up We got both of the deer carcasses. Guess we light a fire by one of them and cut them up, get them ready to go. Poor fool, he fell off the hill. And I got so much stuff once again. Alrighty, deer taken care of. We'll haul all this to the front of the cave in case it ever needs to be utilized. We'll know where it's at. We're already well tired, but that's okay. We should be able to make our way back. It should be getting on to being in Aurora anytime, so we'll find out what happens when we get outside. Might just take a real quick nap. Oh, I would waste the coffee I drank, but that's fine. That's a good spot right there. You know what? Drop those two right there as well. We may be here a couple of days, so... Uh, I don't want this either. That can stay right there. All right, cool. We're still well over what we need to be, but let's go see what else we can do. Is it the Aurora yet? Looks like it's just starting. Okay. I'll take this with us then. Oh, I'm so slow. It's amazing. Let's go back over here by the, the building. See what's available. See if we get any signals in this zone. I don't know. I've never tried and I didn't look it up because why, why, why would you look something up like this when you can just go experiment it? Is that a 
another fish laying right there, or is that just the ice? It's another fish. I'm gonna be so heavy right now. We're gonna need to do a little bit of uh, inventory management. Yeah, look at him come. We got them all come. <laughs> And then the wind blows. Come on. Just want to get within sight of the front side of Hibernia. So I can make sure the wolves don't eat us. real quick all right so uh let me think about this for a second where is all of this other junk that i want to get rid of i know i have a bunch of stuff on me let me drop some more of that and god i don't have any need for all of these flares so many wet stones and go ahead and just drink that one down again Okay, cool. Let's go outside. And essentially, like I said, we've got to wait till the lights over here turn on. So the lighthouse is running. Why did you put the torch down? That was weird. Okay. This is on, right? Yeah, it's on. All right. So we're just a little bit early. Well, if we're just a little bit early, we'll take a, a, an hour nap and that should get it full on in. So sleep for now. Of course, we're gonna just waited for a half a second, but that's fine. All right, let's go take a look. Yep, turned on. Lights are on. That also means everything should be an Aurora bear or wolf right now. All right, lights are on, good deal. Do we get a thing in here? Where is it? It's on the bottom. There it is. Probably no, given the size of this zone. Let's go further this direction real fast. Oh, oh, there's something here. Where is it going to be? Still my favorite place in the whole wide world in this game is that, that lighthouse at this time of night when this is going on. Astrid, 
you can do it. Let's find the next one. Is it over at what's her name's quiet clearing? Seriously? Well, that's a walk. Let's go. Okay, so maybe they are worth looking for. Holy! That's cool. I mean, I guess that's kind of a mid-late game kind of an item, but at least it's a spare pair of pants. All right, let's get up here and we'll put her to bed. Neat. Take the shortcut. Come on. There we go. There we go. And then up and around the corner. Okay, oh crap, I left that thing out there, didn't I? But we'll have to check that in the, uh, in the next episode. So that's plenty long enough for right now. I will see you all in the next one. We did find us a cool thing, and I guess we get to read one more deal. Wow, that's bright. I need to fix the brightness again. Water's leaking in through the floor around the drive mechanism up top. The ceiling up there looks shot. I went down to Hibernia the other day to see if they had a bit of something I could patch it with, but no luck. A useless bunch like always, but the fellow the but the fellows there have their own problems by the looks of it. Alright, well cool. We'll see you all in the next one. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.